Hey, what's up, you guys? Old MPS here. Sorry if my mic's kind of off. One second. And, uh, yeah, so, uh, episode 22. Here we are. And, uh, the map is, technically speaking, finished. The, uh, actual roller coaster part of it is done, so I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a quick run through of what the map is. Uh, so I'm gonna race through it. If I die, I'm just gonna place another mongoose where I died at, what like, the last checkpoint was. But hopefully I don't die, so let's go ahead and root with that one on. So, uh, yeah, so I say the actual track itself came out well. I didn't have too many issues with it. Actually, the track was very, uh, worked with me quite a bit on this map. Normally the track doesn't end up, uh, working out this well, especially the ending. Like, I like the ending now. Uh, I altered it slightly from, like, the last video, but it works way better now. And, uh, yeah, I really enjoy it. So, uh... Yeah, let's go ahead and check this out. So we're going to go ahead and come down here. Back into our little platforming section that we had here. We're going to come up here. And... Hit this. Okay, so I did end up going backwards. But normally that you maintain a ton of speed. And you just go around here. And uh, we're good. Alright, you guys. So, are you ready to see... What's in the box? Yes, it's a release date. We get to see what's in the box. Okay, so before you guys get over worked up about it, it's actually not that great. But you know what? What the hell? It's a freaking dragon. Yes, I built the dragon. All right, so I know you guys were kind of looking forward to what it is, and it's just a fucking dragon with a weird ass looking mouth. I don't like the mouth. I'm probably gonna change that up in a future video. But that's the aesthet the aesthetical theme of this map is actually Skyrim. So, uh, we got this basic Skyrim dragon. He's got all the crap, the cool little spikes. That's where all my inclines went, <laughs> as you guys can see. And actually, I had a better... One second. I thought I had one incline left over, but I guess I didn't. But, uh, we'll change that, because I, I got... I built a second version of him, and he has... Be he's better with, like, an incline, like, instead of these weird-ass ears I built. So, we'll change that later. So, the theme is Skyrim. So, uh... That's why I needed to incorporate some land in here, so I can do this. So, uh, back here, I was trying not to make it as obvious as possible, but we're going to make this, like, uh, one of those, uh, one of those, uh, s sanctuaries where you can get the dragon priest mask and so on. So, we're going to have to, so for the first part of the uh, thing, we're going to have to come up with something flat, and, uh, the best flat object besides the uh, the bottom of that, which is way too large, the bottom of the, what do you call it, is the actual rock flats. Even though they're the second best flat piece, the issue with the other one is that it's just way too big and would not look natural. So, uh, we're going to go ahead and create this wall here, the standard wall for the actual, uh, the actual sanctuary. So, we're going to make this slightly bigger. And we're going to make a word appear on the wall that you can harness with your powers. Uh, this is the only actual aesthetical piece I thought through ahead of time. So uh, this one might go a lot smoother than the other parts of the map. Just saying right now. Get that over with. So uh, yeah. Don't expect any of the other pieces to come out looking decent. I'll probably work on the dragon a little bit more. So uh, like I said, I was kind of amazed that no one's taken this theme yet so far. Uh... Because, I mean, really, I, I thought someone would come up with the idea of building a Skyrim-based map. But, apparently, no one's actually really... Like, I'm a huge Skyrim fan. I got really addicted into it. And, uh, so... I mean, I guess... What the hell? I guess I'm the perfect candidate to do it. So, that's the little wall. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to build, like, a random word out of it. But, first off, one second. I'm going to look up a picture of how the, uh the uh, wall looks so let's go ahead and google images dragon sanctuary skyrim sanctuary skyrim sanctuary skyrim someone text me again uh... dragon priest probably would be better cause Yeah, not good, because uh, all I'm getting is pictures of the actual dragon priests themselves. Okay, so, uh, nope, that won't work either. Okay, so maybe this will do. Full-size image. No, it's too... We 
you're looking. Skyrim word. Skyrim. Tinning word. Sorry, even though I'm not moving at all. I'm just trying to actually find a picture of one of the sanctuaries that look like, okay, that's not what I wanted to see. So, uh, that looks kind of like it. That's not what I want, though. Moving through, moving through, moving through. Nope, 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 nope. Hell, I'll just go off of the other picture I saw. Where is it? It's too small. No, I can barely see anything. That's not very helpful. Ugh. Maybe I should take the obtaining part out. Skyrim word. Here we go. Alright, full size image. Alright, so, uh. Sorry about that. So, uh, after that, like, they got the really flat wall. Then they've always got some sort of insignia on it. So, uh. But they actually have a background to it, which is always something that actually kind of looks like this. So, we're gonna go, like, here. And we're gonna go ahead and. Take this guy. And make this up to here on both sides. How long is this video already through? I'm sure that's quite a few minutes. I don't know. Only at six. Maybe we'll finish this prop first. Uh, I probably should have done that ahead of time and looked up how it looks. Sorry about that, you guys. But. It should look decent, hopefully. So, uh. Not the type of rock I wanted. Spire 1, here we are. So, we're gonna go ahead and kind of create that arcish look to it. And then we're gonna have to create some sort of a square look here. Okay, first off, that prop's not far out enough. There we go. So, uh, so we're gonna come up with a. We're look and we're out of inclines. Ah, uh, shit. Naturals. Okay, well, just get rid of these guys because I'm gonna put something different there. So, uh, medium rocks. How big are the? How big are these? Uh, they're bigish. Um, I don't want to do a C stack or an arch because the arch. Well, I guess I could do a s arch if I do it like this kind of lookish to it, but if someone goes behind it, it's going to look like crap. Well, maybe I can just try to avoid getting people to go behind it. So we'll go like with two right here. And we have to come up with some sort of insignia on here, which will look weird, I'm sure. That just looks wrong, actually. Looks very wrong. We'll go back to the mediums. So, one, two, three, Four. Let's make these try to look like they're jutting out more. So, all right. So, some sort of insignia has to go onto that. But good thing about this is that uh, you can put. I don't know if many people know this, but actually, in the real game of race, weapons do spawn. So, we'll go ahead and put a gravity hammer. Fixed and put on the fastest respawn time, of course. And we'll put this across and put this across the other side. And we'll put like a kill barrier right there in case someone tries to get close to it to take it because I don't want people running around with weapons in my map. So we'll do something along the lines of this. You know what? Yeah, I got an idea. Because the basic X would just look kind of weird. Fixed. We're going to go ahead and do like this. Sorry about not talking much. I'm just kind of preoccupied. As you can see, I'm thinking a lot, trying to figure out how to make this look as cool as possible.
Let's see, what's another really big weapon that's very obvious looking? Besides a gravity hammer. You know what? Screw it. Let's just fucking do it. That'll work. So I don't know what the hell that's supposed to look like. It's just supposed to look like something. It's like a cool insignia. And probably should be lower, but you know what? Screw it. Actually, it's more of like wall art. So you know what? Screw it. Too much money to do it. Alright, so, uh... The words look really strange, so I'm gonna do that by myself on a separate video. And, uh... That's kind of it for right now, you guys. This is OMPS signing out, or subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.